Now, can you believe it? 23 years ago, today in 1995, South Africans united to observe Heritage Day for the very first time, a day which we are encouraged to celebrate the cultural diversity of our traditions, our beliefs, and the contributions of all South Africans in the building of our rainbow nation. Now, as, uh, as we are in Dr. Nelson Mandela's centenary year, we have invited a radio station that speaks the language of his heritage, which is, of course, his cause, uh, to express it today, to unite us all wonderfully in celebration of this wonderful day. Please welcome in breakfast the Ayo Zayo XN from Mshabonene. <laughs> morning, morning, gents. Morning, gentlemen. Very, very good. Always such a pleasure to have you here. The energy you bring with you. How has the, the, the journey to us been? I know you've traveled a little bit as well, yeah? After a very tough weekend, I mean, Mafa was all over the, the, the place over the weekend. At home. Yes. We are slowed the car, so I was very busy. Okay, okay. Yes. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm glad you, you, got, you got it all done as is, yeah. as is necessary. But, yes. you know, you, you talk about traditional ceremonies that we have at home and, and the many other traditions that we follow. Yes. Yeah. Today, probably the height uh, mm. of those as we, we come together as a nation celebrating mm. Heritage Day. Pablo, to, to you, what, what is the, the importance of observing a day like this, like Heritage Day? Uh, it is taking us back. Uh, it's reminding us uh, as, uh, as to exactly where we're coming from and yeah. where we're going. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very, very important yeah. for us. Yeah. How, how do you guys see us celebrating this every single day in our daily lives so that Heritage Day is not just today, mm -hmm. but mm -hmm. every single day in mm -hmm. some sort of small way? How, how do you figure we could actually do that? And especially when we look at the younger generation and how yeah. we can infuse our traditions, our cultures, our beliefs, our heritage in their lives as well, because it, it is important. Mm. Mm. I think three things are important when you ask that question. One, the language. We have to make sure that we yes. teach our children to yeah. speak our language yes. at home. Yes. yes, English might mm. be a medium of communication mm. for mm. business mm. Yeah. and at school, but uh, I think it's very important mm. that we speak Sikosa or whatever home language mm. there is for mm -hmm. the children mm -hmm. at home. Secondly, in our food. Yeah. What we mm. eat. Yeah. Uh, last week, only one on, on Kanya Kriyazan. They mm. actually had pasta made from um. Mm. Mm. Yeah, exactly. Azania. 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 And thirdly, okay. not forgetting uh, sharing past experiences with right. the older generation, yeah. how things were done, so mm. that we carry the torch, as Lloyd said, mm. so that we know where we're going. We mm. learn the olden ways. We should not forget those. So, yeah. If yeah. those three things come and they represent heritage with us. Yeah. Absolutely. Now, when, yeah. when I think about Umfra Buenen, you enjoy one of the largest listenerships across yeah. the country. Yeah. I think mm -hmm. we're talking numbers in the millions. Five, five point, point five. Yeah, five point, point five. We come mm -hmm. second to Kozi. Can you believe it? Yeah. Hey, a strong competition there. Yes, it's a tight competition. So I, I'm sure that a day like this on the airwaves is very busy. Very busy. The very busy. Calls, uh, tell me about what happens on Umfra Buenen today. Who oh, our script? Uh, <laughs> a lot of things that, are, that, that we have on the, in our show today, yeah, yeah. including the, the history, yes. uh, why uh, today is so important, mm -hmm, and mm -hmm, also mm -hmm, the best mm -hmm. uh, birthdays, the important birthdays. Uh, people who are celebrating their birthday today. Uh, you see pe people like Smongi Lekuma, Mama yes. Omeiwa, mm -hmm. Mama Gambete, the wow. speaker. Yes, yeah. yes but yeah, mm -hmm. I'm telling you. And also we'll, uh, we'll be looking at some of the top stories, yes. big mm -hmm. stories that were happening over the weekend mm -hmm. and the week uh, uh, as we go through the week. Yes, yeah. Mauteta Ngo, Mamu, Sibongi uh, Lukumalo, she, mm -hmm. she sings one of my favorite yeah. renditions of mm -hmm. Yakalingong. Yeah. Yeah. Oh man, that song inspires me so much. Yeah. I, I want to ask from each of you gentlemen, because I feel like mm -hmm. today is also a day of sharing and exchanging in culture and mm -hmm. heritage. Mm -hmm. Perhaps if you could share with us one thing that you think people out there do not know about the Iskosa culture or uh, heritage or history that you feel is important to you? Is there something like that that you wish you could share mm -hmm. with mm -hmm. South Africans mm -hmm. as a whole for us to absorb and to learn? We are very loving. <laughs> <laughs> Secondly, <laughs> we call the Eastern Cape the, 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 the province of legends. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. province mm -hmm. of legends. Yes. Yes. Talk about people like uh, Tata Mandela, Tata Tata Mandela mm -hmm. Tata Tambo, Raymond Klaba, and mm -hmm. so many others, Walter Sisulu, all of them come from the Eastern Cape. And they're proudly close. Yeah. And we also Ubuntu. Yeah. Yeah. Ubuntu is our thing as yeah. people because we, we don't mind where you come from. When you visit us, you will feel at home anytime. Yeah. Yeah. 
And also, you know, there's something that uh, people, uh, they would love to, to they, don't, they don't know how to say our clicks. Yeah. We yeah. enjoy yeah. our clicks, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. all those kind of stuff. <laughs> uh, so we feel very proud of that because yeah. I guess we're the only, oh, okay, maybe send other people uh, mm -hmm. uh, don't understand this. Yes. Send people. We'll be hanging out with the crew all morning long, so of course keep it locked here on SABC3. You can also stream us live on YouTube. Listen to Mklaba FM on 88 to 106 megahertz.